Seven years ago, in my hometown in Malaysia, I found myself utterly lost trying to care for my dad, who was suffering from diabetes, heart disease, and other lifestyle conditions. It was deeply frustrating moving from one hospital to another, experimenting with different treatment options, and seeing multiple specialists who never really communicated with one another. It was all so fragmented, and I felt confused and anxious trying to navigate the, the journey that was my, my, my dad's health journey, especially as I do not come from a healthcare background myself. All he needed was someone to help coordinate his care across doctors, diagnostics, and treatment plans. It seemed so simple, but yet it was not available. At the same time, a friend, Sanjay from Singapore, was going through something very similar with his dad who was diagnosed with cancer. Realizing that our experiences were not unique, we talked about how we would improve things. And these conversations continued until we had a complete plan to co-found a business that would address the issues that we'd faced. Our vision was to provide integrated health management to improve both patient experiences and subsequently health outcomes. We looked at countries where our integrated solution would have the highest impact and thus picked India. We chose a name, Connect and Heal, and before long, I had packed my bags and moved to a country where I knew absolutely no one. When, when we first started, we had to solve for three main questions. Number one, where would we get our patients from? This was probably the biggest challenge. And we got around it by targeting large corporate enterprises and insurance companies to provide care for their employees and subsequently their families. This allowed us to impact a larger number of people from the get-go. Now number two, joining the dots. How would we be able to provide end-to-end -end care? Well, this happened organically. We started out running clinics in offices and factories of our corporate clients, which gave us a very strong clinical foundation. Very soon, we realized that primary care is not complete without preventive care. So we started partnering with diagnostic centers and hospitals to provide preventive screenings across the country. Today, we have a network of 3,700 partners providing preventative care across 8,000 PIN code districts across India. <laughs> Next, we realized that even the emergency response space was fairly fragmented. So we took over an existing ambulance business and after a series of improvements, we brought down response times to an average of 25 minutes, um, and also developed India's largest private sector network of ambulances with over 4,400 vehicles in over, across 100 odd cities. <laughs> the picture was nearly complete. We were now providing an integrated solution across primary care, preventive care, and emergency response. Now for the final question. How would we use technology to provide a seamless solution for our patients? We answered this by creating a unique online to offline platform. This means that anyone with a health problem can connect to a doctor in under five minutes through our telemedicine and be offered the right health intervention, be it diagnostics, medicine delivery, in-person consultations, hospital assistance, emergency management, et cetera. And all this comes with a care manager to monitor patient outcomes and support throughout the entire experience. So where are we today? Currently, Connect and Heal serves 6 million people across 400 corporate clients in 300 cities in India. We've completed 1 million care interventions across our health tech platform and managed 250 odd on-site clinics whilst providing round-the-clock assurance of care. 
Our system means that patients across all strata of society, be it the country's highest earners to blue collar and gig workers who might otherwise not have access to medical services, now do. And by providing a bundled solution, we have reduced healthcare costs and ensure continuity of care to influence health outcomes for our patients. What's next for us? We are focused on building the country's most trusted health maintenance organization. This is very much needed in a market where 65% of health expenses are borne out of pocket. We want to keep our patients out of a hospital by managing and monitoring their health so they're not burdened by avoidable diseases. Our biggest lesson and my message to all of those looking to make a difference in healthcare is never stop innovating and always put the patient at the center of everything that you do. Because if you are truly patient-centric, growth, scale, impact, these things will follow naturally. Thank you very much. <laughs>